Accurate estimation of the 3D pose and shape of people and images has many applications. Here we see results for a few of the most accurate current methods. Current state-of-the-art 3D human pose and shape estimation methods fail in challenging real-world scenarios, particularly when they consist of children or are occluded by other people, objects, elements of the scene, or even camera frames. Existing 3D human pose data sets are limited in the complexity of clothing, environmental conditions, number of subjects, lighting, and occlusion. We introduce a new realistic synthetic data set called Agora that addresses limitations of previous data sets, reveals failure modes of existing methods, and even leads to better performance on in-the-wild data sets. Agora uses commercially available high-quality textured 3D scans from Render People, Human Alloy, 3D People, and Axis Design with varied pose, clothing, and identity. To each scan, we precisely fit a simple X body model to provide ground truth 3D body pose, hand pose, and facial expressions. Given multiple scans of the same person, our method considers semantic, geometric, and subject identity information to estimate their simple X parameters. To fit scans of children, we extend the simple X shape to include a new shape direction that interpolates between adult and infant body shapes. Optimizing this extra interpolation parameter, along with the standard shape parameters, gives significantly better shapes and poses for children. The reconstructed simple X fits yield, on average, 5 mm of shape error and can be considered as ground truth. In total, our dataset uses 4,240 3D scans with more than 350 unique subjects. Next, we render up to 15 scans in a realistic scene with random variations in orientation, number of subjects, intersubject distance, and distances to the camera. We use a mix of high dynamic range images in which people are placed on a ground plane and synthetic 3D scenes that provide environmental occlusion. Many existing data sets use pre-lit body renderings that are then alpha composited over 2D background images to generate the synthetic images. This approach does not correctly capture the lighting of the background scene image on the body surface as shown in the top row. Instead, we use image-based lighting with high dynamic range panoramic images to properly capture the environmental lighting on the rendered bodies, as demonstrated in the bottom row. This includes the generation of ray-traced shadows on the ground surface, which provides an important visual cue for ground surface distance in 2D images. We render around 14,000 training and 3,000 test images. We provide the training images with ground truth simple X and simple bodies, as well as 2D segmentation masks. We provide test images without ground truth data, but with evaluation code and a web-based evaluation server. Agora provides a challenging evaluation data set to test current methods, but it also provides training data to improve them. For example, we use the Agora training set to fine-tune spin. We find that despite being synthetic, fine-tuning on Agora improves the performance of spin on 3D PW, a natural image data set. We also evaluate the state-of-the-art human pose and shape estimation baselines on the Agora test set. Agora enables an in-depth analysis of errors with respect to multiple variables like amount of occlusion, body orientation relative to the camera, and adults versus children. Here we show the dependence of errors on the percentage of occlusion. As the amount of occlusion increases, so does the error. Since Agora has 5 to 15 persons per image, methods may not detect every person, leading to false negatives or misses. As the amount of occlusion increases, the percentage of misses also increases. To account for misses and encourage the field to come up with methods to deal with occlusion, we normalize the average joint error by the percentage of correctly detected people and call it NMJE for normalized mean joint error. Methods suffer under this new error measure if they produce a large number of misses. All current methods perform poorly on children. We have presented Agora, a new data set to advance the field of 3D human pose and shape estimation. By leveraging realistic 3D scans of people, realistic scenes, and realistic lighting, Agora provides a higher level of photorealism than previous synthetic datasets. Our graphics approach allows us to go further and generate challenging scenarios with occlusion that would be hard to capture in real scenes. These challenging scenarios show limitations of existing methods and will drive the field to develop more robust and general methods for 3D human pose estimation. Despite being synthetic, we show that Agora is sufficiently realistic to be useful for training, improving the performance on real images. 
Future work includes better integrating the observed probability to the robust loss function and using photometric loss to further improve the registration.